Hi guys, thanks for visiting us at RAF Aquaculture. So today we're going to talk a little bit about the sand filter that's used for vertical crab farming. So as you can see, the sand filter we have here came along with the system when we purchased everything. Uh, do take note for those who are intending to buy systems like these that the equipment supplier usually do not send you a sand filter that has sand inside. You have to procure your own sand and size them accordingly to the pressure drop that you want and the flow rate that you, you need. So this is an extra point to take note of. So we'll next cover uh, what are the major components. As you can see, this is the model number that we are actually using in our, in our farm for 1,000 crab. So it came, as we mentioned earlier, it came part of the whole system, not inclusive of the sand. Uh, other components uh, are, for example, you have uh, you usually add in the sand to the top, and we'll take a look at uh, the first part, which is the outlet tubes. So this is the valve that is used to control what sort of mode you are running the sand filter in. So right now we are in the standard mode, which is the filtration modes. So usually I will only toggle between two modes, which is either filtration or backwashing. So we do routine backwash every day. Uh, this is to minimize the buildup on the filters. So another good indicator to tell you when to backwash is when your pressure gauge runs up to the red zone. So we usually have our pressure gauge. Uh, we usually have our sand filter running at about. 15 to 18 psi as you see there's a lid uh, below the sand filter this is for you to drain out the water uh, and the side glass here although it's not very clear because of the flash that I'm using to light up my video so essentially this glass could be used to double check your conditions of the sand inside the sand filter so uh, this is the cover the hatch in which it the very you open it up the very first time uh, to put in sand as you can see there is a, a blue color a blue color a release valve on the top this is to release any air that is trapped inside the sand filter and once you have it all filled up you should be only a, a water coming out and that's it 